So here's a tool we developed for a real estate investment company. The tool's purpose is to make it easier for their loan managers to manage the loans. We're looking at all of their loans right now. This is their data. So one row represents one loan. It looks like we have about 400 loans that they're managing and a whole bunch of columns associated with each loan. We're all the way out here at column number HA. That's 209 pieces of data associated with one loan. So their loan managers are changing information for each of these loans every day, and you can imagine how cumbersome that may be with all of the left to right scrolling that would be required. So they came to us to make this process easier, and this type of job is right in our wheelhouse because we really stress having a clean user experience with every tool that we provide. If the solution has powerful functionality, but a burdensome or cumbersome user experience, that really devalues the solution as a whole. Every tool should be easy to use. So now let's get into the good stuff. I'll show you what we did to help them. We created this property analysis tab. This is a brand new sheet that we added to their existing workbook. And you can see that it just organizes information. We're looking now at their property on Cherry Lane. And you can see that what we did is just create an excerpt of their short sale information, foreclosure information, property information. So not only does this solution make it easier for the user to review the data, the really cool part about this tool is that the user can actually change information for an individual loan from this nice easy to look at view. So note that the information is always being stored on their existing raw data tab. This is just a magnifying glass so to speak of that information and if you change the information here it will be reflected back here on the raw data tab. So I'll show you that now. Let's change this months to complete trustee sale. It's currently at six months before we change it, let's make sure that it is indeed six months on the raw data tab. If I click this button, it'll take us back to the raw data tab and highlight the property on Cherry Lane. So here we are, it's highlighted row number 163. We are indeed on Cherry Lane. I've shrunk the text for privacy purposes, but this is the right property. Now let's go over and check out the foreclosure months to trustee sale. Yes, it is at six months. So let's go back to the property analysis and we'll change this 6 to a 10. You can see the formulas update and boom so now this is a 10. And so you can do the same thing for all of this other information here. It makes it very very easy for the user. And taking a look at a new property is as easy as using the drop down box here. Or what you can do is go back to this tab and alt click on a cell in another row and it'll show you that piece of property. So that wraps up this tool. This is a small process management tool. I think it only costs twelve or thirteen hundred dollars and the value it provides is really big. And if you take a look at the next video, I'm going to talk about the agile development model we used in creating this tool. That's in contrast to the standard fixed cost development model. And the agile model allows us to get started developing sooner and to ensure that each feature really is designed as appropriately as possible for the client.